The D man. Yeah, shout out my nigga from D's Media. You feel me? <laughs> Yo, it's your boy D's Media back again with another video. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel on the road to 100K. Today, we're going to talk about 650 Mike, man. Just posted on IG and he let it be known, bro. He's still alive and he coming back harder than ever. Let's jump straight into it. 650 Mike um, tragically was hit up. I believe he got hit up in the eye. Um, uh, he was with a female. Uh, the female tragically lost her life. Um, also with some kids in the car, I believe. But... At the end of the day, man, 650 Mike, bro, I just hope and pray, man, that you get your life together, man, because the life that you was living and, and the road that you was headed, man, you lucky to still be alive. Take this second chance at life, man, and, 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 and get right with your God, get you some money and take care of your family. But all this 800, 650, gang banging, all of that, bro, you need to leave that alone, bro, because... It almost cost you your life, bro. And if it wasn't for the man above, bro, that saved you, bro, you wouldn't be here right now. So take advantage of this uh, uh, this second chance at life, man. You know, when you woke up in that hospital, man, the first thing you should have did, man, was thank God that to still be alive. Because a lot of people don't survive a tragic incident like that. You talking about the eye? You know what I'm saying? But it was reportedly that he passed away. But, you know, he, he let it be known that he's still alive. Um... But I just hope and pray, man, that, that this brother and a lot of young, other young brothers, man, start to realize, man, that we only falling for the plan, man, by harming each other. You know, they, the, 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 the day we come together and work as a team and unite and stop this black on black crime, a lot of rich billionaires, grandkids, trust funds ain't going to get paid no more. A lot of rich grandkids ain't going to school no more. A lot of rich grandkids ain't going to have them million dollar trust funds. Because when you sit back and you think, it's so many uh, departments, agencies, and races that make money off uh, a young black man taking out another young black man. Police make billions off of us losing our lives. Doctors make billions of dollars of us losing our lives. Pharmaceutical companies, because the first thing you do when you get hit up, what, what they give you? They give you pills. Ambulance make billions of dollars. They got to take you to the hospital. Judges make billions of dollars. Lawyers make billions of dollars. Everybody make billions of dollars. Commissary. Like, just pay attention. Everybody makes money off of black on black crime. And the only person that's losing is us. We losing our kids. We losing our, 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 our young brothers. We losing the OGs out here. And, and the one thing that I see every day is, is that we wake up every day and we don't take advantage of the tools and the materials that we got to be successful, but yet we want to blame the next person for the reason why we don't have something. You'll get up all day and jump on the iPhone and tweak out with your ops and go on a block and go live and show this and show that. When that same iPhone, somebody across town is making millions of dollars off of doing business conference deals or, or doing this or doing that. So take advantage of the opportunities you got. Because at the end of the day, don't nobody hold you back but yourself. Your only downfall in life is going to be yourself. You know what I'm saying? But stop letting these older guys and these and these shorties out here put a battery in y'all back to think that something is cool. Yeah, it look cool when they standing on these blocks with these Drakes, these Tim Mills, and they gang, 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 this, this, and that. But what happened when they ops slide through and somebody lose their life? You know? Or what happened when somebody backdoor they homie and they lose their life? That's the part of the streets that they don't want to tell y'all. So while they glorifying the game banging and, and the shooting and this and that, what happened when you lose your life? What happened when you go to jail for the rest of your life? What happened when your homies backdoor you? You know what I'm saying? What happened? What happened? What happened when you lose your life but you still got kids out here, or baby moms? What happened when your when when your baby moms need money for this and that? What's going to happen? Or what's going to happen when you tragically go to jail and your homie messing with your baby moms now? That's what come with the streets. So I just hope and pray, man, that 650 Mike and a lot of these other shorties wake up, man, because at the rate that y'all going, man, y'all giving them exactly what they want. They they don't want us to unite and, and, and be as one because the, the strongest and, and the most fearful race, if they ever come together, be African-Americans because we got sports, you know, we 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 getting business smart now. We ain't we ain't back in the slavery days. We business smart. We ain't going for nothing. 
You know what I'm saying? All we got to do is come together, man. And I'm trying to tell you, man, we are, we are, we are scared a whole bunch of people, man. They'll be, man, they'll be so scared of us, man. I'm trying to tell you. But as long as we keep giving them what they want, keep destroying each other, taking each other out, you got people that's going to sit back and just keep laughing and making billions of dollars. But it's your boy, D's Media, signing out. Peace, positivity, network growth. Let's say these kids. D, man. Yeah, shout out my nigga from D's Media, you feel me? <laughs>